hello you're welcome how to solve this nice algebra equation here let's take x to the right hand side and here we have 5 raised to the power x equals to 7 minus x from here then also here we can divide both sides by 5 raised to the power x and this side by 5 raised to the power x here, 5 raised to the power x, we cancel each other. We have 1 here. And from here, we have 1 equals to 7 minus x. Then we can write this as times 1 over 5 raised to the power x. And also, applying the law of indices, when we have 1 over a raised to the power n, the same thing as a raised to the power minus n. That is here, we have this as 1 equals to 7 minus x, then times 5 raised to the power minus x. And here, we are intending to use the lambda w function when we have w alpha exponent alpha. This same thing as alpha from here. That is, here the power and the coefficient will be the same. Now let's make the power of you know five here to be seven minus x. Here it implies that we multiply both sides with five raised to power seven. So this side times five raised to power seven will still be five raised to power seven. Then equals to here. We have 7 minus x, then times 5 raised to the power 7, then times 5 raised to the power minus x. Then from here, since we have seen this here, we can have this power, which will be 7 plus minus x, which is still 7 minus x. So we have 5 raised to the power 7 now equals to 7 minus x. Then times 5 raised to the power 7 minus x. Then from here, we can rewrite 5 from when we have exponent ln a, the same thing as a. Then it implies that 5 can be written as exponent ln 5. Then here we have 5 raised to the power 7. I equals to 7 minus x then times here we have exponent ln 5 which is raised to power 7 minus x here then from what we have we can apply the law of logarithm the power law here we can take the power to the back here then we have 5 raised to power 7 now equals to 7 minus x then multiply by exponent 7 minus x now, then ln 5 from here. And since we are using the lambda w function, which has the power and the coefficient of the exponent equal, then here we have ln 5 multiplying this. Then we have to multiply this by ln 5 as well, which implies that we multiply both sides by ln 5. So here we have 5 raised to the power 7 times ln 5. Now equals to also 7 minus x times ln 5. Then multiply by exponent 7 minus x ln 5. Then from here we can introduce the Lambert W function. So we have w into 5 raised to the power 7 ln 5 then equals to w into 7 minus x ln 5 then exponent 7 minus x ln 5 then close bracket that is here what we have still remain w 
into 5 raised to the power 7 ln 5. Then what we have here, we reduce to 7 minus x ln 5 from here. Then from what we have here, let's divide both sides by ln 5. Then this side divided by ln 5, this side divided by ln 5. This cancel each other. Then we have W into 5 raised to the power 7 ln 5, which is divided by ln 5. Now equals to here we have 7 minus x. Then since we are finding x, we have minus x here. We can take it to this side. It will become plus x. Then equals to here we have 7. Then take everything here to that side. We become minus w into bracket 5 raised to the power 7 ln 5. Then divide by ln 5. So here we have the solution to this given problem. And which we can also put in decimal by using the calculator. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up. See you in next class and bye for now.